Hello friends! What we're looking at in front of us is a saguaro cactus that is badly diseased. Unfortunately, this saguaro has seen its better days. Right now, it's badly infected with a disease called bacterial necrosis that rots the cactus from the inside out. Unfortunately, there's really no way of saving this cactus because of how far this disease has progressed. If we take a closer look at the cactus, we can see some of the affected areas. We take a look at parts of the base of the cactus. We have decaying splines. We have a very dark matter oozing out of the base of the splines. If we take a look up farther in the cactus, we see all kinds of damage. We see holes, we see rot, we see bird holes that are starting to decay and also rot away. These are all signs of bacterial necrosis that's going to do this cactus in. The reason that I wanted to feature this cactus is to give an example to property managers and property owners of what not to do. Now if we take a look back here, this very badly diseased cactus is in the middle of an island right around a parking lot. Now, today it's mostly empty, but on the weekends, the parking lot at this country club really fills up, and someday the saguaro is going to come down on its own. There's no telling which way it's going to go, but if it falls down in any of three different directions, it could easily hit a car, a pedestrian, or someone in a golf cart. So to any property manager, homeowner, or anyone with a diseased cactus, that has bacterial necrosis or any other type of ailments, make sure you consult our certified arborists and tree experts to make the best decision for your cactus and your property. If you live in the Phoenix metro area, visit us online at valleytreetrimmers.com. Thanks for watching.